Hello my friends and welcome to our brand new blind let's play Omoi for the PS5. My name is The Flatless Bird, this is your story based gaming channel and today I'm super excited to play this game because this game was voted on by you, the number one YouTube community in all of YouTube and I can't wait to figure out what this game is about because I know absolutely zilch. I, this, I am coming in completely blank, I haven't read anything about it, I don't know anything about it. I just know that you guys voted on it, so therefore, it must be pretty awesome. So, together, let's figure out what this game is all about, shall we? I hope you're all having a wonderful, fantastic day today. Don't worry. Everything is going to be okay. No matter what happens, promise me that we'll always be there for each other. Promise me. I almost get Jimmy and the pulsating mass vibes from that opening. Open your eyes. Welcome to white space. Okay. You have been living here for as long as you can remember. Can move around now. Uh, okay, this is a little bit weird. Uh, I'm down for weird though. Like I said, just playing Jimmy the Pulsating Mouse right now and I'm really loving that. A tissue box for wiping your sorrows away. Your sketchbook. Take a look inside. Okay. What the? Uh, I, uh, uh, what is going on in this kid's imagination? This is so weird. What is going on here? And then we have empty pages room for more writing. Got a kitty cat here. Meow. Waiting for something to happen? The cat's talking to me, I guess. You booted up your laptop. What would you like to do today? I guess stare at the screen? And we're staring at the screen. What would you like to do? Open your journal? Today I spent time in white space. Everything was okay. Okay. What would you like to do? There was something on the bottom right there. I guess that's our journal. The heat from the laptop warmed your lap. It felt nice. Something fell nearby. What fell nearby? That that thing on the bottom right almost looks like uh the uh what's that what's that creature called from Undertale? Oh, I forgot it. The the, the the little guys that like there's a whole town of them. I know something fell, but I don't know where it is. A white door casts a faint shadow. What would you like to do? Apparently nothing. You stare at the door. Sure, stare at the door. 
Huh? What was that? You got a shiny knife. Is all this? Oh, we can actually uh, do stuff now. So we have a shiny knife. You can see a reflection in the blade. We have sad poem, inflict sad on a friend or foe, and we have guard. If acts first, to do is take it for one turn. And of course, the option menu, which I've already configured before starting the video. Can I fight these things? No, they just take me back there. Okay, what is that thing that fell? A light bulb hangs from the ceiling, wherever it is. Look at the light bulb. It's pitch black inside. You can't see a thing. What if I just had to click on the ground? Didn't mean to re look at the light bulb. I can't find that thing that fell nearby. It's somewhere in this space. Hopefully I'm not the only one that was really confused when they first played this game. So something fell nearby. But I don't see anything. And I'm clicking everywhere and I don't see anything to click on. I've already gotten the shiny knife. Oh, that's the light. That's the, uh, the cord from the light bulb. Ah. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. I gotta be missing something like really, really obvious. I think that fellow was probably the key to the door. Oh! I, I guess we automatically picked up the, the thing. That fell. Huh. Aubrey. Hi, Amori. We were hoping that you'd come by soon. Wanna play cards with us? We're just about to start another game. Oh, whoops, never mind. Oh man, what the heck, Aubrey? Miss up all the cards. I was winning too. Hey there, kill. No need to get angry. It's just a game after all. Don't give me that. Don't give me that, Kiro. You only saw that because you were losing. Huh, the dots. 
All the light bulbs, apparently. What the heck? Huh. A tentacle is sticking out of the ground. Is this Day of the Tentacle? You got a stuffed toy. Can't go off screen anymore. Single bean on a plate. Photo of someone familiar. Would you like to make toast? Sure. You made toast. A fluffy pillow shaped like the head of a girl. A neatly wrapped present. A blender. Baseball and a baseball bat. Cat shaped hole. And look, it's purple, like, and you can actually see through the hole in the distance. There's a movie on TV. Four boys are walking on railroad tracks. Sss. Waiting for something to happen? It's weird that the cat said too. Oh, there's something up there watching us. Giant cat. What's up, Murray? We've been waiting for you. Mel and Arby have been fighting a lot again. You would think they get it tired after all, but they're just so full of energy. Yo, Mari, look at what I found the other day. It's a pet rock. Isn't he awesome? I had a pet rock as a kid. Pet rocks are awesome. I love the instruction manuals that come with it. They're just so funny. A tiny pet rock stares at you from inside Kel's pocket. I'm gonna name him Hector. Okay, just don't run into any Achilles. Why is Kel always so mean to me? You know, the other day that good friend of stole my stuffed toy and hid somewhere in this room. Why would he do something like that? He's so immature. I mean, what did I ever do to him? Oh, I know. Can you find my stuffed toy for me, Amari? Lady, please? Already did. Is that... Could it be? Yay! Amari snatched the stuffed toy from him. Hey, Kel. Look, it's my stuffed toy. What the heck? How ah, where'd you get that? Amori found it. Like it for me, I got some real friends. Yes, serves you right, Kill. You should know better than to pick on others. But Abby started it. She was the one who was making fun of me for the mole on my... On your... What? Uh... Aubrey. Fine. Hey, Mari, I'm glad that's all settled. There's always two seem to be bumping hits. Mari and Basil invited us for a picnic at the playground. You want to go see them? Sure. All right, everyone, let's go see Mari and Basil. Oh, looks like we got a little trip here now. Okay. We have Aubrey, Kel, and Hero. They all have, uh, Kel has the most HP, Aubrey has second, or Mori. So as MP goes, Kel has the most. Kel seems to be like Superman. Got the most HP and the most MP. She can't toggle, unfortunately. So we could do R1 and L1 to like, you know, jump between characters you can't. Uh, Mr. Plant Egg makes a weird noise when you punch it. Rubber ball. Playground tested child boot. Oh, they got stats. What the heck are these stats? Heart, juice, attack, defense, speed, luck, hit. Uh, uh, heart must be the HP. Juice must be the MP. And then attack, defense. Doesn't seem to have magic attack. 7, 4, 5, 7. Uh, so he's got the highest... Because he probably has a better weapon. 7, 4, 5, 7. Seven, four, five. Okay, she's the weakest of the all, but she has a high attack. Seven, four, five, seven. He's the slowest of them all. He's got a spatula. Good for flipping burgers. Okay. Going out, Amari? Here's your last for today. You got 50 clams. Oh yeah, fresh air at last. Gotta love that nature. Let's go. Hey, wait a sec. What? Help me up, guys. I'm stuck. 
I don't think you say please. Hey. <laughs> Kel, stop messing around and get me out of here. Ah, okay, okay, fine. Yeah, just a little push. Oh. Huh. Took you long enough. <laughs> I love how he went flying backwards. Well, sorry, princess. <laughs> Classic line right there. You know what that's from. Kudos to you. Uh, left is always right. Let's go left. Game was very fast. Very surprised by that. But that's cool. Just zooming around. There seems to be a spider web here. You're afraid of spiders. Okay, well I guess we're not going left then, are we? We'll go up then. You want to build a sandcastle with friends? Sure. That sounds like fun. Oh my gosh, he built a he built a giant sailboat? Oh look at little bunnies. And we actually built a castle. No, he built a castle. What did we build? We just built a giant lump. What the heck was that? You were afraid of drowning? What was that? What is going on in this game? Why am I playing two RPGs at the same time? Why the first thing I ask is what the heck is going on in this game? <laughs> ah. By the way, if you haven't seen Jimmy the Pulsating Mask, go check it out. It's pretty awesome. You're afraid of heights. Okay, I, I, I am actually afraid of heights. And cockroaches. Hopefully there's no cockroaches in this game. I guess down is the only way to go. Oh, playing hopscotch. What's that giant creature? What kind of world do we live in? Some of our friends. Mari, Basil. Oh, hello, Aubrey. Hello, everyone. How are you all doing today? Cal's being mean to me again. Oh, no. Not again. How could he? Psh. I'm not being mean. I was just being a whiny, that's all. Well, Kel, you made, you just made a very convincing point. Now I don't know who to believe. Believe me. No, believe me. <sighs> Settle down, you two. Why does it always have to be like this? Ah, uh, chin up, hero. Look at you being all responsible. I really like that about you. Haha. <laughs> Come on, Mari. Not now. Oh, hero. You know I'm just teasing. You're so cute when you get all flustered. Ugh. While we were waiting for you guys, Basil and I were going through his photo album. Do you want to join us? Of course. After all, we're the ones of the pictures, aren't we? Hey, Basil, Basil, get a load of this. Come on, Basil, take a picture of me. Sorry, Kel. I only take photos of people when they least expect it. You like to take photos of people acting natural when they're not in front of the camera, right, Basil? Yeah. There is something special about everyone living their own lives. Those are the moments I want to capture. So, like, 
Ah, we just have to pretend that you're not there? Uh huh. Yeah, I guess you could put it that way. Sure, I could do that. Do you want to show us your photo album now, Basil? Uh, okay. But it's nothing amazing. Oh, Basil, stop downing yourself. I'm sure they'll be great. Uh, you're right, Aubrey. Sorry. Uh, I try to believe in myself more. Uh, here. This way we can all see. Aww. Pictures are so adorable. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Aww. Oh, look at them all. Best friends. And was that square? Ready? All of our feet in a circle. Can you guess whose feet? Or whose? Oh, I didn't even realize there was a, uh... I didn't realize that was an option. Hold on, let's go back. Mario is teaching everyone how to make flower crowns. Amori and Kel are holding Mario's example. So pretty. Amori and Kel gave up and ran off, but Aubrey and I got the hang of it really, really fast. Hero is still making his flower crown. It's taken him a little while, but he's getting it. You have to admire his persistence. Everyone's eating watermelons. So juicy. Aubrey has some seeds on her face. Maybe someone should tell her. <laughs> Kel drinking a bottle of milk, his favorite. I shouldn't get too close, so I might get my camera wet. Mari had Hero take a picture of us. Everyone thinks a flower crown really suits me. Hero leaning in for a smooch. Kel looks so annoyed. Ah, brotherly love. Oh, are they brothers? We're having a picnic today. Mari wants to take a picture of everyone. Say cheese! After eating, everyone fell asleep, except Mar Hiro and Mari. I am getting kind of sleepy myself. Kel said he took a picture of himself on accident, but I don't believe him. No more? What's this? Writing but no pictures? Weird? These photos are also charming, Basil. You really know how to capture the moment. Ah, uh, thanks. I didn't take all of them, though. Mario likes to steal my camera sometimes. Only sometimes. Uh, I have an idea. I do want to come hang out at my house. I just finished planting the little sprouts and want to show everyone. Come on, uh, they're really cute. Yeah, sure, I guess that sounds like fun. Uh, let's go. It's south of the playground, right? Yep, that's the way. Hmm. I think I'll sit this one out. You will go on and enjoy yourselves. But if you're feeling ready, you can always stop by one of my picnics. I always have some refreshments ready. And you can even save using my picnic basket. Providing some bears don't steal it. That's so annoying. I, I always have to have extras just in case. Oh, thanks, Mari. You're always doing so much for us. Hey, Mar Mari. Uh, bye. We'll see you again soon. Run along and have fun now. You know where to find me. Got a whole troop now. But I can't. I only have these four in my party. Mario's picnic basket. Do you want to see? Yes. So I guess this is like the inn. You, you look for these and that's how you save and that's how you restore your, your uh, stats. Ah, yeah, some nutritious candy. You want your friends for like the. Yeah, so this is basically like your heal slash save point. 
I'm going to the, I'm going to swing to the moon. No boss zone. Violators will be prosecuted. Nose looks occupied. Nose is my best friend. She can't say much, but she's really smart. Burley talks so fast when she's excited. It gets really hard to keep up. Hey, Moy, guess what? I got some blitz today. Big plans. Just stay pro for a while. You'll see what I mean soon enough. <laughs> hey, wait just one second. Where do you think I'm going? You can't live without joining such a game of hide and seek. Same play with us. The more the merrier. You want to play hide and seek again? Ah, but you know how this turned out last time. Yeah. Sorry, Burly. I think we're gonna have to pass. And we're going to Basil's house now. So, uh, we'll catch up with the rest of you later. Not so fast. You guys trying to avoid me again? What's up with you two? Is it my face? My mother of Death's career? At least I'm not as bad as boss. It's a good thing I banned him for the playground after last time. What happened last time? I wonder what that morn is up to now. All the dots. Eh, good riddance. So, you want to play hide and seek, Basil? Uh, I can go either way. There's so no rush to get to my house after all. I think I'll leave it up to Omari. What do you want to do? Yeah, I have no idea if it's Omori or Omari. Sorry if I mispronounce it. If if you want to correct me, I'll do it in future episodes. But for now, I, I just know it as Omori. Um, yeah. Omori, Omori, my best friend. Come on, you, you want to play hide seek, don't you? Hey, that's what I thought. What's happening then? Come on, let's play. I'll find everyone up. Tina. All right, Maggie, scissors rolls. We're gonna do entertaining things with that little game of hide and seek. Here, my hands. I got some straws. See, and where's the hands? Gotta pick a straw. The one the short straw is gonna be it. We'll have to find everyone else. So that's easy enough, right? We all got a straws? Good. Now let's see who's gonna be it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Looks like the most short straw is Amori. Amori! Ah, wait, Amori, is it? Saw one coming. But Amori doesn't like to be alone. Are you going to be okay, Amori? I can take a place if you want. I don't mind, really. Hey, I hear you plotting over there. The straws make the will stop me. Come on, don't be so baby. Zinni, it's so bad. Amori will be fine. When you're ready to play, walk up to the tub vault and close your eyes. And hope you can rot. Uh, don't worry, Omari. I know you'll be okay. You can do this. I believe in you, Omari. Hey, you got this in the bag, buddy. You'll be fine, Omari. Just believe in yourself. Nose goes. I wonder where me and Nose should hide. Hmm, can I even hide anywhere around here? <laughs> Try my best. Yawn. I feel sleepy. Yay, it's time to play. Ah? Huh? Sigh. I don't know where I hide. I'm not creative at all. I like the names too. Just accept the pull when you're ready to start. Come on, I'm worried. Don't be your baby. Five, four, three, two, one. Lift off. I mean, go. Wow, you found me. Now I can help you find everyone. So, Bailey, tell Bailey about this. Got it? Heh. <laughs> Aw, oh, you found me. Darn, he. Let's go find everyone else together, Omari. Huh? Where am I? Sigh. I was dreaming that I was on a bright beach with servants, uh, fanning me with palm trees on every side. When suddenly, wham! Now here I am. I must fall asleep while hiding. I guess this came over for me. Oh, hey guys, huh? You know, huh? Find a really good high spot, huh? Johnny, man, huh? Might be joining them in there. Exercise routine. It's fun and good for you. You guys should really try this. It's, huh? Really, huh? Workout. Oh man, I'm so tired. Wow! You 
really don't know how to say no to anyone, do you, Hero? Come on, Hero, we gotta help Omri find everyone else. All right, all right, <sighs> I'm coming. Bye, Sean. Bye, Ren. This was fun. Yeah, let's just get some time. See you later, Hero. We're not playing, we're exercising. We're not playing, we're exercising. Darn, you found me. I guess that means I lose. You know what Happy would say right now? You say something like, Bangs, you should always try your best at everything. I want some people to see how awesome you are. Uh, next time, I guess. Turns out, there's not many places I forgot my size, but this is still fun. As long as Burley is happy, I'm happy. Nose goes, if you don't know how to hear us. Nose goes, bungos. Happy quiet knows what I need, remember? Aha! Found you, funny news. No, they found us. No, it goes. Oh, you know I can't say mad at you. Let's go play patty cake. He's asleep. Patty cake, patty cake, baker's man, bake me a cake as fast as you can. Am I still missing someone? Missing Burley? In the mailbox? So this is blue mailbox. Music is nice. I'm missing. I'm missing Burley. Hi, Amari. I see. I see everyone decided to say a bit uh, hide and seek. If you're having a hard time, I can lend you a hand. Big sister is always here for you. <laughs> so, would you like some help? Sure. From what I can see, there's still three friends left to find. You can do this, Amari. I'm with you for you. Three friends? Three? Where the heck are three at? Very difficult piece of puzzle. All the pieces are falling. Boing, it's me happy. You found me, so that means I gotta go do something else now. Oh yeah, I know, I'll cut the outfit backwards. C Y X W B U O M M M O. <laughs> we found one. What's the best at? Eternal banana. Yo yo. Still kind of backwards. Ground feels nice here. Uh... Okay. Where I'm still missing two. For these last two B. Last two at. Whisper, 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 whisper. Oh, I should disturb this. So they're not part of the group. I'm pretty sure the mailbox has something to do with things, but I bet you that's after we find the last person. Where is the last friend at? Still two left. Where are the other two at? We 
and they're not gonna make this difficult, right? But yet. Why am I stuck on a kid's game? Pick a boo. Oh, there's straw on the ground. Pull on it. Ah! Took guys long enough. I thought it was gonna suck in there. Did you like my high spot? Pretty good, eh? Yeah, it was pretty good. I walked right by it like 15 times. It looks like pretty much what anyone else too. Unexpected, but I like it. Now uh, let's do a fun of work call. Ten up! Thought there was one left. Man? Here yeah, as always, buddy. Charlene? Here? Mikhail? Zzz. <laughs> ah, what gives? Happy? Here? Browse? <laughs> Bangs here. Fun. Fun is here. Nose. Nose goes. Hero. Present. All sparkly too. Cal. <sighs> really gotta do this every time, Burly. Ah! Hey, that was a call for. Ah! Why you dirty? Aubrey. Here I am. Hmm, uh, where's Basil? That's strange. I thought I saw him going hiding near that tree over there. Basil, where are you? Can you hear us? Basil, you can come out now. You already won. Hello, Basil! Hey, there's Basil. Uh, Basil, are you okay? Arr, are you stick? The heck? <laughs> oh, it's the boss, the guy they banned. Boss, I should've known it was you. You good for nothing, scoundrel. Let Basil go. Yeah, what did Basil ever do to you? Basil's our friend. Don't you dare hurt him. Let go of Basil, boss. He didn't do anything wrong. <laughs> ah, you stupid heads! You think this is about Basil? Don't play dim! You know I'm here? How do you not invite me to hide and seek? I'm the one who showed you all how to play in the first place. And I ain't even playing it right. How can you call hide and seek without any body slam him? Oh, my flower crown! Hey, that's the flower crown we made for Basil. Uh, how could you? Let go of him, you bully. No! If I can't play with everyone, then no one can. As the boss only zone now. And you're not invited. Oh, first fight. Oh, look at our little guy. He's stuck. Tax knack. Toy. So, inflict sad on a friend of a foe. Okay, yeah, I don't I, I don't know why it was defaulted to my characters. I want to use it on the boss. Uh pet talk, make a friend of her happy. Axe first, reducing damage chicken. Let's just have you attack. Make a friend and no angry or act first. Okay, let's do that. Uh heal friend 75% of the heart can be used outside of battle. Oh! So we got a healy here. Mario reads a sad poem. All six, eight damage and three juice. Oh, you you lose juice when you get hit? Oh, I think juice is your HP. So he takes 10 damage and he loses. No, juice is your MP. <laughs> you weaklings, call out a dick. We already got him sad, so no reason to make him any worse than that. My text boss. 
right in the heart. Oh, that must be a crit. It's got punch for six. Hey, that kind of hurt. Yeah, this ain't fun anymore. Boss cracks his knuckles. Dang, now you made me angry. It's time for my special move. Body slam. Oh my god. Oh my god. What? Amori did not succumb. Huh? How are you still moving? Okay. I got one option here, and that's to attack. All right, we've got 32 experience to 22 claims, and everyone became toast. Quite literal toast. Oh, gotta love that. The literal toast. That isn't fair. Rematch! I want a rematch! Oh, nice kick. Basil, are you hurt? Uh, don't worry about me. I'm just fine. Boss, it must hurt to see people have fun without you. But that doesn't mean you can ruin other people's fun. Heh, I know that. Aww, there. Does that feel better? Aww. Basil, you sure it's okay to do that? Ah, boss is bad news. It's a good thing Amori you had on during that final attack, or else we would all be toast. It's okay, I trust him. Uh, when you were all fighting, you tried really hard to make sure I didn't get hurt. Is that true, boss? Ah, uh, yeah. Well, that's a load of baloney. I didn't need to hear these lies. Ah, uh, this is my spot. No one is welcome here. <laughs> well, he probably won't be a problem as long as he stays like that. I guess that means we can go to Basil's house now. Well, that sounds good to me. Now oh, we're leaving now, boss. Don't cause any trouble, okay? Ah! Okay, I'm ready. Let's go. Let us eat some candy first. And one is back to full health. And save as well. Those are my best friends, she's really smart. I like puzzles. Hello, friends. Hop, and a hop, and a hop, and a hop. Ah! Having fun takes too much effort, so watching my friends have fun is enough for me. Tonight's a perfect night for stargazing. Grass sure feels nice here. Wanna join some more? Sure. The stars shine brightly overhead. You don't have a care in the world. Aww. A more learned observe. Okay. Does that tell me how much HP someone has? Uh, nope. It will tell me what the foe's gonna do. Okay, that's very interesting. And it looks like the purple bar is EXP. Omori's only one got EXP on the last one. Yes, yes. Fellow customer, welcome to my shop. Please buy something. Kick, kick, kick. Oh, the, the mailbox are shops. Heal 30 hearts. Heal 25 juice. Small damage to all foes and reduce the speed. It's not what you want, it inflicts anger. You know, I can already inflict anger. Definitely want to get some food. Let's get two of these. Let's get one of these. Don't really have a lot of money to buy a lot. Train station, Pimble Forest, and Basil's house. Transportation savings doesn't be in service. Wait, Amari, we're supposed to go to my house. It's just past the south of my playground. I just planned finishing those sprouts and wanted to show everyone. Come on, they're really cute. 
Okay, well that tells me what happens when I go off track. A watering can. Oh, these are sunflowers. They're called that because they always face toward the sun. That's how I want to be like. Someone who always sees the bright side of things. Aww. I like that attitude. I, I always want to try to be like that too. These flowers are called Lily of the Valley. Said that they're able to ward off evil spirits to see a brighter future. I guess that's why they remind me of Mari. I can always count on her to help me stay positive. They almost look like uh, Narcissus flowers. Or the Narcissus flower. Although there's no water for them to lean towards. Whoa! What's that ugly plant creature? Don't you know, Cal? That's a sprout mole. Sprout moles are highly intelligent creatures but become dangerously vicious when they are lost. Please, Mr. Sprout Mole, stop that. You're stopping all over my flowers. Ah, it looks like the Sprout Mole is angry. Like us, Sprout Moles also feel emotions. So the Sprout Mole is angry, its attack is higher. By the other hand, it lowers its defense. So what you're saying is now is the perfect time to strike? Come on, Amari, let's do this. So it's basically Berserk. And Berserk is not a buff. Look at that, Zappa. It's not a buff. You gain 22 experience and 3 clients. Omari grew to level 2. Ah, uh, most of the flowers are unharmed. That's a relief. Hey, Mari. Now that we're getting the hang of battle, here's a journal we can trade back from any neat foods that we come across. Here we'll give you the faux facts journal. There, now it's in your pocket. The journal is yours to record with, but we might pitch it sometimes too. Check it out through your pocket and play mini by pressing circle. So is that like the uh, thing from Bravely Default where you have like a notebook? Um, pocket. Oh, facts. A dangerous hostile print creature. It says that it's smart, but do not believe it is not. It smells like dirty laundry. Don't worry. That's a lot of enemies in the game. Boss, a little rough around the edges can be a foe or a friend. Okay, how much did your stats grow? Not much. So this is a game where plus one to a stat really makes a difference. There are, there are, in RPGs, I always like to know when I'm going in, does plus one of a stat make a difference? Because there's some games where plus one stats really don't make a difference because you have, you know, 100 attack. But in this game, it does seem to make a lot of difference. Oh, these are roses. Can you guess who they remind me of? Uh, they remind me of Hero. Did you guess correctly? Roses come in many different colors and they have their own unique meanings. Pink roses symbolize admiration. Orange symbolize passion. Yellow symbolize friendship and the list goes on. Hero doesn't remind me of any rose in particular. I think Hero is all, like all roses because it's versatile and universally loved. I thought you were going to say it reminds me of Mari. Ah, these are a type of flower called the gladiolus. The, the gladiola what? Gladiolus, also known as the sword flower. As you might guess, they represent the strength of the character. Someone who's honest with strong moral values. Someone who stands by their convictions. The gladiolus reminds me of Aubrey because she always is true to herself. Always be true to yourself, my friends. Oh, I see. So what you're saying is that Aubrey is really stubborn. Hey, no I'm not. Eh? Ah. Okay, let's move on. Wow, Aubrey may have just become my favorite character because she's true to herself. Oh no, not again. Please, Mr. Spoutmall, stop twirling and destroying all of my flowers. Oh, I see. This Sprout Mall is happy. In that case, has a higher chance to hit a weak spot and do more damage. This also means it has a higher chance of missing. Okay, so this is teaching me about all the emotions, which is really, really cool. Oh my gosh, look at that. Oh, that's adorable. That's such a cool attack. It's rolling around.
Hmm, we well, seem to be running a lot of foes with emotion. In case you don't know, emotions determine how strong or weak an attack is. A happy beats angry. Angry beats sad. Sad beats happy. So it's like the weapon triangle in Fire Emblem? Oh, I should probably write this. So happy um, beats angry. Angry beats sad. Sad beats happy. I'm gonna probably draw a diagram of that later. Here, I even drew up a guide on how they work. I'm no artist, but I think you'll get the point. I'll put the pocket so you can check it out later. Kind of motion chart. Yeah, that's that's kind of what I was going to draw. Oh, oh. Lock up, speed up, hit rate down. Attack up, defense down. Defense up, speed down. Oh, some damage to heart is juice. That's why when I hit the boss, he was losing juice. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna have to take like a screenshot of this or something. Hey, what are these slides called? Oh, cool and spiky. Actually, Kel, this is a cactus. It's more of a plant than a flower. And it's funny you ask because it reminds me of you. Is it because he's a prick? Oh, wow. Hey! Well, that too, but mostly because cacti are really sturdy and resilient plants by nature. They don't can't need much care and can survive in its seemingly impossible conditions. I guess what I'm saying is, is that even if you could take care of a cactus, Cal? Whoa, neat. Cacti are awesome. Oh, that was really nice. I like Basil. Ah, uh, these are white tulips. Plain, simple, and bulbous, just like a Mori. I don't know, I just think it's cute. Oh, no, no, Sprout Mole. So good, Basil. Ah, we got the hang of this now. Hmm, this Sprout Mole seems a bit sad. See how it's curled up in the fetal position. That means it won't do as much damage as normal, but I'll stick less damage to heart and we'll lose juice instead. How sad. Let's put out of its misery. Well, it's like for one of your characters to get sad. Because then you lose your mana. It's super tanky, though. Super duper tanky. Oh, okay, there we go. Oh, we go to level two. Cal go to level two, and Hero go to level two, and learn mas massage. So here is our healer. And massage removes a friend of foe's emotion. Hi everyone, you came out on just in time for a lovely picnic. Feel free to rest here. Everything is already set up and I even bought some fruit. Oh, so it's okay candy we have fruit this time. So I wonder if the campfire scenes are similar to Star Ocean's private actions. Was it the Tales game's private actions? One of the two? Or if it's just a really neat picture. And hey, I'm okay with a really neat picture because it's an awesome picture. Uh, so do those fruits. Like, it's some absolutely. Much, much, much. Woohoo, thanks, Mario. You're the beast. Oh, it's nothing. I'm just trying to look out for all of you. Oh, Mari, I wish I could be more like you. You always seem to have everything under control. That's not true at all. It just seems that way from the outside. Either way, it sure makes... It seems to make everything look easy. Yes, I agree. Mari is so effortlessly graceful. Don't you think so, Mari? Yeah. Aww. I guess I have to believe it a little bit, if you all think so. Oh, my house is right down this way. Are we all ready to go? I'm ready when you are. Ah, we'll catch you later, Mari. 
Let me know if you need anything. See you soon. Come on, Amari. Have some food. Food is good for you. Okay, we're gonna save here, and I think this is gonna have to be the end of our first video. Uh, thank you all for choosing this game. It's very interesting so far. It's incredibly strange, and I'm okay with that because it just makes me super interested on what's going on. And it immediately hooks you because you're wondering, okay, what is happening? What's going to happen next? And I really want to know. So thank you all for suggesting this game. You are the number one YouTube community, all YouTube, and I can't thank you enough. If you like what you saw, don't forget to hit that thumbs up to like the video and subscribe. And um, let me know in the comment section below what you think about this game, what you think about the first video. If um, I'm saying Omori's name wrong. And also, just just to say hi. I, I would love to hear your thoughts. I would like to just have a conversation with you. That's why I do YouTube after all. To share my love of gaming with you all. And I, I, I really I really appreciate you all. I, and I definitely want to give a huge shout out to our supporters of the channel via Patreon and YouTube membership. Diesel Knight, Dragon K, Moose Gaming, Daddy X, Tegoth. Crafty, Fleeting Day, Inel, Epitok, Tapas, JQT, Techno Trouble. Thank you all for all that you do for me and this community. I I really do appreciate it. Games do cost money, and you know you you help pay for that. So thank you for helping to support the channel. If you'd like to become a supporter of the channel, uh, links are in the description below. Also, there is a link in the description below for something called www.tinyurl.com/flightlessbirdgaming. That is a spreadsheet that has all of my playthroughs that I've done on the channel. So we have over 100 playthroughs on the channel and you may be wondering, well, what has Flightless Bird done? Rather than trying to scroll through YouTube because that will take a while, you can just look at the spreadsheet and you get an instant snapshot of everything that we've done. For now, my dear friends, I hope you have a wonderful, fantastic, amazing, awesome day. We'll be back very soon with more Amoy. And until next time, so long and take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter and you are brilliant and you are loved and you should always be true to yourself. Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.